They're growing calls this morning for a prominent progressive conservative candidate in Ontario's provincial election to withdraw over his actions as a student at Western University going back to 2006. You're seeing pictures here of the candidate, Stephen Lecce, who served in cabinet with the Ford government, including his education minister. He is apologizing for his involvement in a so-called slave auction fundraiser. This was part of a fraternity event, as I said, going back to his days as a student at Western in London, Ontario. Michael Serapio is back with the latest information we have mm -hmm. and what NDP candidates are coming forward to say, Michael. Oh, that's right, Heather. Three NDP candidates, all of whom are black, penning a letter reacting quite angrily to this report that was initially published by the Press Progress website. And in that reporting, as you said, Stephen Lecce, who served as Ontario's education minister, they they say took part in these so-called slave auctions at Western University. Now, at the time, he was not just a student. He was also the president of the Sigma Chi fraternity, in particular the Epsilon Omicron chapter. And during this time, that fraternity held these auctions reportedly on several occasions, one being in November of 2006, where auctions were held on the 28th and so-called slave days followed two days later, where they were quote unquote sold and served their owners. News of this has that prompted these NDP candidates to write this letter of complaint. Take a look at it. In part, they say uh, that the transatlantic slave trade remains one of the most horrific chapters of human history, that the legacy of slavery, colonialism, and white supremacy still lives in our institutions. End quote. Mr. Lecce chose to lead and participate, they say, in events that mocked and trivialized this painful history. He also chose to conceal them for years as a public official, as a minister charged with the education, opportunity, and well-being of black students, and as the person tasked with overseeing the province's investigations into anti-black racism in these schools. All of these actions, they say, are repulsive and constitute clear anti-black racism, Heather. And what are we hearing, if anything, Michael, from Stephen Lecce to this point this morning? Uh, yeah, well, as you know, he has apologized. And in a short statement, he said that the 2006 event was inappropriate and that it does not reflect who he is as a person. But the NDP candidates do want him to pull out of the campaign altogether, Heather. Michael Serapio, thank you for the breaking news there. You're welcome.